Hello students, welcome to NV Commerce Academy. Our today's topic is mean deviation, which is also known as average deviation. Mean deviation measure of dispersion है और इसे हम तीनों averages means mean, median and mode के through calculate कर सकते हैं. Means जो mean deviation है वो from mean भी calculate हो जाती है. Mean deviation from medium भी and the next is mean deviation from mood. For calculation of mean deviation, first of all, I will clarify the concept with regard to individual series. In individual series, mean deviation ko calculate karne ke liye, suppose main pehle mean ki baat kar rahi hu, तो मीन डेविएशन को कैलकुलेट करने के लिए हमें डेविएशंस जो हैं उन्हें कैलकुलेट करना होता है और उन्हीं डेविएशंस को जब हम सम करके एन से डिवाइड कर देते हैं तो हमारे पास मीन डेविएशन फ्रॉम मीन कैलकुलेट हो जाती है सो हियर डी एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स माइनस एक्स बार विच इज mean and here i am using the mode sign which means we need to ignore the signs so mean deviation from median which is also easy as formula is same but here deviations are taken from median and when we calculate mean deviation from mode in that case formula is same but deviations are taken from mood here i am taking an example where individual series is 5 6 8 10 12 12 and 15 i will calculate mean deviation from mean median and mood in this question so first of all mean deviation from mean for this i need to sum up my series so summation x here is 68 for calculation of mean i need to divide 68 by 7 because number of observations are 7 here so mean is equal to 9.7 so what we need to do is we have to calculate dx mod which is x minus x bar or ye x bar kya hai hamara mean which is calculated as 9.7 so here 5 minus 9.7 it would be 4.7 because 6 minus 9.7 it will be 3.7 1 1.3 1 2.3 2.3 and 5.3 so this is dx under mod so as per formula i have to sum up this column so summation dx here is 20.3 so mean deviation from mean is 20.3 Divided by number of observations kya hai? 7. So 20.3 divided by 7. It would be 2.9. So mean deviation from mean is 2.9. In case of median. We need to calculate median first. And we know that median is equal to size of n plus 1 by 2th item so here 4th item and 4th item here is 10 so median is 10 i have to take deviations from 10 here so dx under mod where x minus median is there then column would be 5 minus 10 5 6 minus 10 4, 2, 0, 2, 2 and 5. Summation is 20. So mean deviation from median 
would be 20 divided by 7. So here it is 2.86. And the last one is mode. By inspection method it is clear that mode is 12. So, अगर हम 12 से deviations लेते हैं, तो 5 minus 12, 7, 6, 4, 2, 0, 0 and 3. And by summing it up, it is 22. So, mean deviation from mode would be 22 divided by 7. So, here it is 3.14. In this way, mean deviation or average deviation can be calculated from averages, from mean, median and mode. Just we have to calculate mean, median or mode of the series and then we just have to take the deviations. After summing up the deviations, ignoring the sign, we need to divide it with n. So, in this simple way, we can calculate average deviation or mean deviation in individual series. To calculate coefficient of mean deviation, if we have calculated it with the help of mean, then we just have to divide mean deviation from mean, which is our calculated answer, hai, by mean itself. So, in above example, if I need to calculate mean deviation from means coefficient, then I just need to divide my answer with mean itself, which was 9.7. So, in this way, coefficient would be 0.298. If coefficient of mean deviation from median, so mean deviation from median would be divided by median. So, mean deviation from median, answer was 2.86 and median was 10. So, here coefficient would be 0.286 and coefficient of mean deviation from mode. So, mean deviation from mode would be divided by mode itself. 3.14 mode was 12. So, here coefficient is 0.26. So, we can calculate coefficients as well by dividing the relative average which is mean, median and mode. Next is discrete series. In discrete series, again we can calculate mean deviation from mean, median and mode. But here formula would be little bit change. हमें अपने deviations के column को frequency से multiply करना है. Deviations हमारी again same है, under mod है, which can be calculated with mean, with median, with mode itself. And again coefficients can be calculated by same formulas. Mean deviation from mean को अगर आप mean से ही divide कर दोगे, mean deviation from median को अगर आप median से ही divide कर दोगे, mean deviation from mode को अगर आप mode से ही divide कर दोगे, तो आप coefficients को calculate कर सकते हो. Here in this example, we need to calculate mean deviation from median and its coefficient. So, for calculation of median, we need cumulative frequency 3, 5, 3, 8, 16, 5, 21 and 4, 25. As we know that median is equal to size of n plus 1 by 2th item. So here size of median is 13th. So for 13 median would be 12. We will calculate our median this way. After that, we can calculate deviations. Means, we can subtract our median from x. So, 10 minus 12. It would be 2, 1, 0, 2 and 5. And the last step is, we need to 
मल्टीप्लाई दिस कॉलम विद फ्रीक्वेंसी सो जब हम इसे फ्रीक्वेंसी से मल्टीप्लाई कर देंगे देन थ्री टू टू सिक्स फाइव जीरो टेन एंड ट्वेंटी वी विल सम अप दिस कॉलम दिस इज फोर्टी वन सो मेन डेविएशन फ्रॉम मीडियन वुड बी समेशन एफ डेविएशंस डिवाइडेड बाय एन सो हियर इट इज फोर्टी वन डिवाइडेड बाय ट्वेंटी फाइव विच इज वन पॉइंट सिक्स फोर एंड फोर कॉफिशेंट we need to divide this answer with the median so here it is we can solve discrete series with respect to mean as well as mode hum pehle series ke basis pe mean ko calculate kar lenge fir jo deviations hai wo mean se aur fir frequency se multiply then after application of formula answer can be obtained in case of continuous series formula would be same bas hame jo deviations hai wo mid value se calculate karni hai as we know in continuous series mid value represents the x so first of all we will calculate median here for calculation of median cumulative frequency is required that would be 16 16 12 28 18 46 57 and 60. So, median class के लिए n by twoth item, so thirtieth item. When we check thirty here, so that would be our median class. So, for calculation of median, our formula is L1 plus n by two minus C F upon F multiplied by I. So, L1 Sixteen plus n by two, that is thirty, minus twenty-eight divided by eighteen multiplied by four. We can solve it for the median, and answer would be sixteen point four. What we need to do next is we need to calculate mid values. Four and eight mid value would be six, ten, fourteen. Eighteen, twenty-two, and twenty-six. Next, deviations, which can be calculated by subtracting median from mid value. So six minus sixteen point four, ignoring the sign, that would be ten point four. Same as we will construct this column like this. and our final column would be frequency multiplied by deviations jab aap frequency se ise multiply kar doge so our figures would turn like this after summing it up it would be 274.4 so mean deviation from median would be 274.4 divided by 60 so here answer would be 4.57 so continuous series mein just hame ek mid value ko calculate karna hai aur usme se hi deviations ko calculate karna hai else all other things would be same so this is our concept Average deviation or mean deviation from mean, median, and mode.